easily the most anticipated UFC debut of 2018 thus far. Striking wizard Israel Adesanya makes his first walk to the octagon for a showdown with Australia's Razor Rob Wilkinson. You ready? Let's go, gentlemen. A lot of the headlines have been garnered by his opponent, Israel Adesanya, but a big opportunity for Wilkinson tonight. He is in blue, the newcomer Adesanya in black. So the mental side, Wilkinson coming off the first loss of his career, a knockout loss, which stopped pretty late. He took a lot of damage in that fight. How will that affect him going into this one? Already an early stance switch from the switch stance fighter, Israel Adesanya. An accomplished kickboxer. He's drawn some comparisons to John Jones. We'll see if he can live up to all of these expectations here tonight against Wilkinson. One thing he has to do is not let the hype get to him. A lot of people talk about him, John Jones, Anderson Silva, stuff like that. Hey, right. get in there, win the fight, do what you do, worry about the hype later. Don't feel the need to live up to it and then, you know, have a spectacular finish in the first round. Just get the win. Out of Sanye, Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu blue belt under Andre Galvao, but Wilkinson figured to have a grappling advantage tonight. More than half of Wilkinson's pro wins have come by submission. I think he needs to rely on those skills tonight, get an outside trip, get on top. Look at that wizard, beautiful balance. Cow catcher position, wrestling, lets it go. Head chance for this is the kind of fight you want if you will. No doubt about Dirty it. Dirty against the fence, right. grinding. Rely on that clinch. Take the energy out of an explosive opponent. And of course, try to extend a fighter who has never gone 15 minutes in his pro career. 11 0 for Adesanya. All 11 wins by knockout, five in round one. Nice job with the trip. Adesanya, very good job getting back to his feet. Excellent balance. There is a healthy rivalry between Australia and New Zealand. And look at that tenacity with the takedown. Didn't let him off the hook. Stayed with the single leg, stayed with the pressure in the back against the fence. That's the kind of tenacity he's going to need to get the takedown here. Another level change here for Rob Wilkinson. Two and a half minutes gone by round one. Go inside straight away. Like you said, he got on the radar, kind of beating up Melvin Gillard. Great performance in that fight, but Melvin Gillard has fought at 55. Certainly not a natural middleweight. Wilkinson is. Much more physical pressure here than he's used to. Right. Looks like some blood in and around that nose of Rob Wilkinson. Not exactly sure what caused it. Until Wilkinson wants no distance at all. Right. Save strategy against someone like Adesanya. Now we get some separation. About two minutes to go, round one. We'll see what the last style bender can do now at range. Showing some feints here to Wilkinson. So far, being patient. Tend to work from the outside. Nice lead hook right hand. And Wilkinson wants to do a beautiful job with the roll. And that's athleticism, my friend. He rolled right through that. Adesanya makes this middleweight limit with ease. Came in at 183 pounds, three pounds to spare here yesterday. And the takedown defense is largely held up, John. The strategy here, of course, Wilkinson wants a takedown. If you can't get it, just keep this fight close and make it about long-term energy depletion. Take the energy out of my opponent, even if I can't take him down. 42 seconds. And also, test the mentality. This guy's not used to long fights. Make it through and see if he'll get frustrated because he can't get his game going. Pretty good job by Wilkinson to pull that post and get Adesanya down, but only for a couple seconds. Israel back to his feet. Yeah, certainly not efficient with the takedown so far. He's putting in a lot of work for very few takedowns, but 
able to wear Adesanya down. I think that could be the goal in round one. Two takedowns on 10 attempts in round one for Razor Rob Wilkinson. Round two, fourth coming from Perth. Stay with us. Breathe, brother, breathe. Just focus on your breathing. That's what I need to focus on. Just need to get that over there. That puddle over there. Just breathe, just relax. Just don't settle on the cage, just try and get up a yeah. little sooner. Yeah. Okay. And then just, uh, like I said, just like he's catching a little front kick. Yeah. Even though you're flicking it, he's yeah. just diving at it. Yeah. So no kicks. Okay, okay. He's open for the punches. Drop the shots a little low. Well, well, well. Rob, listen. Well, look at the guy sitting on his stool, okay? Look at him sitting so you earned it this round. Listen, I want you to stick to stick to A. Sorry guys. Stick to A. Keep your hands sharp. Keep coming forward. He just stings. Okay? Clinch. Win the fight. Break him down. Rob, I don't want you to break concentration. Okay, let's go. Stay back. Just go back a bit, Israel. Five minutes down, potentially 10 to go here between Israel Adesanya and Rob Wilkinson. Jimmy, any major takeaways from either corner after round one? Yeah, Rob Wilkinson's corner said, look at how he's sitting okay, on the ready. stool. You're he's ready. tired, it's all about energy. Stick to the game plan. They don't want him getting creative and getting knocked out. Adesanya misses high with that kick. You just get the sense everyone is waiting with bated breath to see this highly touted prospect. Wilkinson again closes the distance, whiffs on the left hand. Wilkinson's point, we didn't talk about the takedown, they talked about energy, about wearing him down, breaking him down, and winning the fight. In two minutes, five minutes, we're going home. Get out the big room, let's go. Oh, nice job. Drive the check, let's go. High ground. Nice combination to the body. Like the speed on that jab. Finally a good separation after a takedown attempt. Yeah, Adesanya is starting to get a read it a little bit. On that Wilkinson shot, he saw it 10 times in round one. 12 takedown attempts now for Wilkinson. And that was a big message from the Adesanya corner as well, Jimmy, to focus on the hands and not the feet when it comes to his strike. Exactly. Don't let him catch it and take it down. Make him earn it with a takedown. Oh, even when it gets partially blocked. Yeah, done with these gloves, it makes no difference. Nice knee. Nice job by Wilkinson, though, to stay committed and, and ground Adesanya at least temporarily there. I don't think he had much of a choice. <laughs> Those punches did not feel good. He committed to that takedown. Survival's a hell of a motivator, John. Wilkinson with an underhook here, content to run a little bit of clock. Just over three minutes here in round two. You know, he's doing well with the blizzard. He's doing well, you know, pulling inside, not getting the takedown. He needs to angle off the fence. He needs a little bit more footwork to not be in this position against the, against the fence. Not getting taken down is good, but you want to angle Get back to the center of the octagon where he's done good work. Big deep breath from Rob Wilkinson, Adesanya. Pressing forward. Oh, uppercut followed up with a knee. The strikes are quick and they're accurate. Those might be broken, yeah, a lot of blood a, coming out of it. Looks a little rearranged. And what that affects so much is the breathing. Beautiful job with that defense. Now starting to take Wilkinson apart with the strikes. That hurt him. Not sure how much more Wilkinson can take. Adesanya to the knee, now back to the hands. Moving his head, but not enough. Spit blood on him. Wilkinson exhausted, attempted 16 takedowns, and the end here might be a formality. This, Big right hand. This looks like physical surrender to me. He's not yeah. answering back, just has his hands up. It's not gonna take much for the referee to stop this one. This yeah. is a punching bag right now. Oh, huge right hand from Adesanya after Wilkinson had landed a knee. 
Not sure how much more Steve Percival needs to see. There's a knee. Yeah, this guy is done. That's it. Israel Adesanya. So, so according to him, but the last style bender does it 12 and 0. He makes good on the UFC debut tonight. What I like about that finish is that there was no one big punch. He didn't load up for one shot. It was a lot of accurate strikes. No overcommitment to any one shot. Good maturity with his striking, for sure. And the takedown defense certainly held up for Adesanya. Let's get to the move of the fight. It is sponsored by Metro PCS. Bringing you closer than ever to the UFC, putting knockout coverage in your hands by covering 99% of people in the US. And look at these shots. Beautiful stuff with the jab. That's what set everything up. Combinations to the body. But look at it here, an even paced attack. Didn't go crazy, didn't go nuts. Didn't allow Wilkinson to clinch and get the takedown. Right here, body, head, knee. Great combinations, angling as he's punching. This is the kind of finish you want for your first UFC fight. It showed that he has real maturity on the feet. The rest of the strikers in this division, you're on notice. And Adesanya made it very clear, getting to the UFC is not the dream. This is only the beginning. And he gets it done in a big way here tonight. We will talk to Israel Adesanya as the prelims continue live from Perth. Go nowhere. A lot of eyeballs on Israel Adesanya here tonight.